Hi boys and girls, welcome to the library. This video is going to teach you the new way to check out a library book. So here we go. When you walk into the library with your book in your hand that you are finished with, you're done with it, you're ready to put it back into the library, you're going to check it in. So here I am, I'm coming in, I want to check my book back in because I am finished with it. So I'm going to look at my book, look at the back. I'm going to want to find the West Clayton Elementary School barcode and then I want to pick up this scanner. It has a button on it. So I'm going to push that button to make the red light come up and I'm going to listen. I heard a good sound and then I'm going to check the computer. It says my book's title, The Wishing Spell, and then it see my name. I'm going to pretend today I'm Orin Lamb and it's checked in. So now I'm finished with this book. I need to put it on the cart. So I'm going to walk over to the cart and I'm going to put it back. Now I'm going to get a shelf marker. Last year you guys used shelf markers with your name, but not anymore. This year you get to pick a random shelf marker. So I'm going to show you where those are at. You're going to come right back to the computer where you checked your book in and there's a basket. I put lots of different fun sayings like dream big or be kind. Always, I like that one. So I'm going to pick this one and I'm going to go find my book. Today I'm going to look for a book on maybe sports. I think I want something about gymnastics. I'm going to use my shelf marker. I want to try this book out. I'm going to put it here to hold my book spot. And then I'm gonna take this book out and then I'm gonna look at it. Hmm, let's see, you know what? I don't really want this book. I'm gonna find my shelf marker so I put it back the right way. Remember, when you put your book back, you want the spine to be showing and you wanna put it back where your shelf marker is waiting for you. Then it's back, I'm gonna take my shelf marker out and find another one. Let's see, maybe I want something about pirates. I like this pirate book, if I could get my shelf marker in there. Sometimes it's kind of tight. All right, here we go. Oh, my shelf marker fell out, but it's okay, because this is the one I want. So now I'm gonna get my shelf marker, and I'm gonna go to the check out computer, because I wanna take this pirate book out. So I'm gonna come here. You'll know it's the check out computer, because it says check out. Right now I'm looking at the screen and I see Miss Berger's name is on there and I'm not Miss Berger so I need to click the reset button. So here is the reset button that I want to click. So I'm going to come to the keyboard and I'm going to get the mouse and I'm going to come over to the computer and I'm going to click reset. I also want to make sure it says check out. Now that it's ready I need to find my name. I can do two things. I can type it right here or I can go to the new binder of barcodes. So I'm going to open this binder and I'm going to find my teacher because I am in Miss Lee's fourth grade class. So I'm going to find the tab for fourth grade and there it is. And then I'm going to look. When I look at the barcode it'll say a name and then it'll say the teacher. So that's Chidsey and they're in alphabetical order. So I need to turn until I can find Lee, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K. Here is Miss Lee's page. Now I want to try to find my name and they're in alphabetical order. So my last name is Lamb. So I'm here, J, K, L, Lamb, Orin. That's me and that's my barcode. So I'm going to pick up this scanner. The red light's already on. I'm going to scan it and then I'm going to look at the computer. Right now it says my name and it says items out. There are no materials checked out. Great, now I find my book and I find my West Clayton Elementary barcode and I run it through the red light and then I look to make sure it's checked out to me and it is, I'm good. Now I just need to return my shelf marker back to the basket where I got it and I am ready to go. One fancy tip, when you're checking a book out, you might wanna click the reset button after you check your book out to make sure nobody comes behind you and tries to check another book out. The way you're gonna do that, if you look at the screen, there's the reset button, and then over here you get the mouse, and then you come back, and you click reset, and then you see that your name is off the screen.
Now, what if you come into the library and you get your shelf marker and you decide you want to get a book. Let's just say I want, uh, I'm going to get, hmm, I don't want one of those. Let's say I want a fairy tale. All right, I'm going to get, how many spots does a leopard have? So I'm going to go back over to the checkout computer. Here's checkout, and I'm going to find my teacher's name, and then I'm going to find my name. Here I am, Oren Lamb. There's my barcode. I'm going to pick up the scanner. The red light's already on. I'm going to scan my name. Now, when I scan my name, I see my name, so that's good. Now, I'm going to find the West Clayton barcode, West Clayton Elementary School, and, uh-oh, did you hear that? That made a bad bonk sound. It says, transaction blocked. Oren, you sing, lamb. Student max checkouts reached. Do you want to complete this transaction? I have to say no because I already have one book out and I'm only allowed one book at a time. So I have to get the mouse and then I have to click no. And then I have to come back after I get my book. Now that you've watched this video on how to check a book in or out, it's time to find your first clue in order to break out of the library. Now it's time to look for your first clue and break out of the library. Everybody has a card that's been assigned to them. So if you're in the fa uh, fauna house, you're going to look for the green. If you're in the sisu house, you're going to look for the purple card. They're all over the library. I'll give you a hint. You want to look for them in a place where you might need to find a book. So maybe buy a bookshelf or maybe buy the animal of your house. You've got to be smart and work as a team. Good luck!